<laughs> I've never seen anyone with a vape. So we go, wait, oh, let me just go. Oh, my vape's done charging. Load it up. And then some motherfucker's like, oh, oh, it's bad for me. If you're so fucking stupid, it didn't cross your mind at some point that permanently sucking on this vape was gonna damage you in some way. You deserve what happens to your dumb ass. Breathe air. You don't need a vape. Masculine loyalty is completely misunderstood. All these dudes out here who are at home with their wife thinking they're loyal, you're not loyal. Loyalty is having options and returning to the same place. Not only having one option. If I walk into the store and they only sell apples and I buy an apple, I'm not loyal to apples. I don't have a choice. Loyalty is walking in the store where they sell all the fruit. I buy apples six days a week. Occasionally I get a big fat pineapple and I go back to apples the day after. That's loyalty. Without choice, there's no loyalty. I don't know if I'm allowed to say this on air. I had a girlfriend once. She was a vegan. I didn't know she was a vegan. Unfortunately, I found out. She said, oh, I'll never cook meat for you. I said, look, well, I'll be honest with you right now. We're going to end up splitting up because you're living in my house and I'm paying the bills. And if I want steak, you're cooking it. That was a good two-hour argument until she eventually cooked the steak. Of course she did. What's she going to do? Lose me? She cooked the steak. She sat there. She pretended she was upset. Two weeks later, she's eating meat. I converted her. I fixed her. One person at a time, I'm going to fix the world. I got straps in my wardrobe. Show the wardrobe. What suit am I gonna wear? What fucking gun? Or on the G? Like that. I'm gonna stay right here in case the police roll. You're not allowed guns in the ring. But you are allowed guns in your shooting range. So I have to get my house registered as a shooting range. But <laughs> you don't know me. <laughs> you know, you don't allow guns in the shooting range over there. Well, they're a shooting range. I'm a shooting range. It doesn't matter if a man slept with 20 girls or 200 girls. He is still the man. If a woman slept with 200 men, she is <laughs> worth less. This is the basis of the Thanks. game. No Thanks. man is going to marry a woman that 200 men slammed and threw to the street. The problem with the Western world, and it, it's the Western world as a whole, but it's especially America. Mm -hmm. Women think they have some kind of power. Oh, well, I'll go sleep with a guy. You didn't fuck a guy. The guy fucked you. And wait, what? Oh my God. So I hope you're not getting angry. We'll The worst thing you can possibly do for your kids is make them grow up rich. That's the worst thing you can do. I was raised poor and I hope I spend it all before I die. And my son can fucking make it himself because all of life's important lessons come from being broke. Saying you're a vegetarian is basically just saying, I don't understand how the world works. Because at the most basic level, something has to die for something else to stay alive. A frog will eat a fly. A lion will eat an antelope. That's the natural order of the world. I'm not saying it's a nice thing. I'm saying it's realistic. It's realism. To just sit and say, I eat cows. Cows die and that means I get to live. That means I live in the real world. You want to sit there and go, nothing should die and I should eat grass. When your body's not designed to do that, you are basically just rejecting a real world view. It's the same as saying, I don't believe in gravity. It's like literally just throwing away any concept and any understanding of how the universe functions. Pretty sure I saw a vlog where you're gonna buy another Bugatti. I've already bought a second one. Which one? I've put another order down for another Chiron. I bought a Kernan's egg as well. I got a Jumeirah on the way. I'm talking to Pagani. I saw that. You put new, it on your story, so yeah, I assumed you yeah, Pagani. You know what? This is another thing about money. I'm gonna sit here and I'm gonna complain. This is gonna upset all the brokies at home. There's nothing to fucking buy. Like, you buy three or four diamond watches. You buy a couple suits. You buy some cars. What else? What else is there to buy? You end up just spunking it on bottle shows and $10,000 stakes. There's nothing to buy.